Ittfaq report Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina has expressed hopes that Bangladesh Navy will one day transform itself to a building force from a buyer one gradually as the government has taken various steps to this end. We will be able to build warships and export these as well, the Prime Minister said on Sunday while addressing the Winter Parade of Midshipmen-2015 and Direct Entry Officers 2017-B batch on the occasion of the President Parade December 2017 at Bangladesh Naval Academy in Chittagong. The Premier mentioned various steps taken by the Awami League government to modernize the Bangladesh Navy. Works are on to construct the largest naval base with aviation facilities in Patuakali, while Bangabandhu Sheikh Mujib Naval Base in Dhaka for infrastructural development, she added. Other than that, the construction work of submarine base in Kutabdia for ensuring the proper management and maintenance of submarines and providing jetty facilities, the Prime Minister added. PM Sheikh Hasina said the work started to construct fleet headquarters in Sita Kunda Sand Whip Channel in Chittagong with shipbirthing facilities. She said modern warships are being made with local technology in Kulna Shipyard and Narayan Ganj Dockyard run under the competent management of the Bangladesh Navy. Two large anti-submarine warfare patrol crafts, Dudam and Nishan, were commissioned in the naval fleet last month, added the PM. The Prime Minister mentioned her government was able to establish Bangladesh's sovereign rights in a vast sea area through peaceful settlement of maritime boundary disputes with Myanmar and India in the international court maintaining the friendly relations with the two countries. After establishing the rights in the vast sea area, our responsibility had largely increased to protect the marine resources. We can use them for our socio-economic development, she said adding that it is the duty of Bangladesh Navy to oversee the vast sea area. PM Sheikh Hasina said Bangladesh is now being considered as the pioneer in the outside world when it comes to mutual cooperation and development in the of Indian Ocean region. Pointing at the midshipmen of the Navy, the Prime Minister hoped that they will engage themselves in the noble duty of protecting the country's independence and sovereignty being imbued with the spirit of the Liberation War. I am glad to know that there are 21 females among those who got commissioned today, which is a big example of women empowerment in our country, PM Sheikh Hasina said. She paid deep homage to Bishrestha Shahid Ruhu Lamin and other members of the Navy, who sacrificed their lives in the Liberation War. The Premier said father of the nation Bangabandhu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman had realized the importance of naval force considering the geopolitical location of Bangladesh and demanded establishment of the headquarters of naval forces in the then East Bengal in the 1966 historic six-point program, but the Pakistani rulers had not accepted it. Bangabandhu commissioned BNS Khan the largest naval training base, in 1974 to build a modern and strong naval force.